Hey. Listen. Hi guys. Is this my new favorite way to start vlogs? Like right in this position? I don't know, maybe. Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. My name is Allison. If you're new here, if not, thank you so much for tuning back in. Um, so I considered like adding this footage from like the vlog that I was filming two days ago. Today's Tuesday and I was filming a video like this past weekend, but I'm not exactly sure that that video kind of like would flow well into this one. So I'm just gonna start like a separate weekly vlog today. And I hope that the other video is enough footage just because I haven't even started editing it yet, but I just like transferred all of that over today. So it is currently 921. I'm waiting for my rice to finish cooking so I can have dinner, but I just got back from Crate and Barrel. Don't worry, I actually filmed some footage this time that I'm gonna insert right here. Mama's favorite store in the world, apparently. Stop, it is stunning. Wait, how much is this? Oh. I like all the full stuff that they Oh, look at my cater ball, you're painting! Uh, what's the one, yeah? Yeah! I don't think we've ever seen it in like person, right? Maybe, I think we have actually. Yeah, gosh, it's... I think just do it, you know? My favorite decanter. That one right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I actually found the table that I want in store. So I'm actually glad to be able to see it. But this is like the square one and I want like the round one. Um, this is like the prices of all of them in case you want to see that. But I really like this table. I actually kind of like the square one really. I thought it was like 
less expensive just because it was smaller but it's actually like a pretty good size for yeah the scale of our living room so i don't know the only thing though i'm just trying to figure out like if this would be like child friendly just because it does have like sharp edges so yeah but i really like it the color is just so beautiful to me and that's what it looks like it's coming off more gray on camera but it's actually like much warmer in person it's like a lighter color so yeah Beautiful, this place. She went to just Crate and Barrel, really, for the evening. Um, I had like a few things that I did around the house, but nothing too exciting. But we are going to be filming tonight. I feel like I'm I'm doing a little bit better when it comes to like vlogging and actually like pulling up my camera. And then in times when I just think like my camera is just like too much, I will actually vlog with my phone instead of like making an excuse to myself. So yeah, let me show you guys what I got from Crate and Barrow and then I'm gonna continue with the rest of my night routine, which I think honestly, as for right now, I'm just gonna eat dinner and then shower and get on the couch and watch like one or two episodes of love island because yeah we're just now catching up to like the past season of love island and it is spicy spicy anyways i don't even remember some of the stuff i got from there i'm like what is this what is this strange so i know like in my previous vlog i actually um had gone to the crate and borrow and um i showed you guys what i got so this is like a whole separate run it just felt like I don't know, maybe I could hit it up like one more time. Furnishing a house is like work, you guys. And also we're like getting rid of stuff and replacing it. Just so we're, we feel like we're at a place where we're happy with all the things that we have in the house and trying to be like really intentional about that. So I'm not like throwing away anything. Uh, I'm actually like either giving it away or donating it just so I don't feel wasteful and yeah. So I have no idea what this is, but it feels heavy. Oh, okay. First thing we got, um, which my husband really wanted this, and I'm glad I'm glad he got it so he can actually get it out of the way. But it's just like this wine coaster right here. So this, of course, is for the wine bottle, and then this is like the coasters that go with it. So it's just like a cute little coaster set, and this actually matches our um, bar like accessory set. So it's, I feel like this for sure now completes the collection. It's the only thing that we didn't have from that collection. So everything else from like our bar stuff was actually on sale except this one thing. But anyways, the next thing we got is just this bowl right here. And we got four of these. Um, we only have like four cereal bowls, which I mean, it's like an okay number. But just in case we have like people over, it's just, I feel like it wouldn't really be enough. Like four is not really enough because... That, yeah, it's just not enough. So um, we got these, which are a little bit bigger than the ones that we have from CB2. But this is from the same collection as like the salad plates that I showed in my other Crate and Barrel video. I think it's Ren, if I'm not mistaken. But um, yeah, I'll put a link for those below, as always. And yeah, just for these, these were actually, I think, 30% off or 20% off today, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, I think they were actually 30% off, so... That was a good deal to me, so we needed cereal bowls. Here we are. And then I got more bowls. Um, so the other ones I got are these, and this is like the craft collection. We also already have like some plates from that collection. We have the gray craft dinner plates. Yeah, so for today, we got like the linen color. I love contrast. I think I've seen this before, so Anytime you see me getting things that seem like a little bit mismatched, just know that I'm actually trying to like play around with contrast. Like this to me is beautiful. Like I hate when everything is like the same color. So yeah, we got the linen color for these, which I was actually initially gonna get the linen colored plates for the dinner plates, but they didn't have them at the time. And then also I just thought maybe the gray would be like a nice addition because at the time it felt like we only had white and black plates, but I really love this color because it's kind of like it's more like a cream color and I struggle to find like cream color um, dinnerware. So 
yeah those were 20 percent off i remember for sure just because i was wondering like why the other color was 30 percent off so if you get the stone color which is kind of like a bluish gray that one's 30 percent off i'm not exactly sure how long the sale is gonna last but everything will be linked down below all right next thing i got was just four of these shot glasses i really like these i honestly think that they look way more expensive than they actually are these were $2.95 and they were also 20% off on top of that, which I think is a good deal really for um, how they look. Oh my goodness. Okay, so side note, I was just like washing the dishes and I had actually seen somewhere when people were talking about you can use Dawn to clean your ring, which I have never tried that, but look at what the Dawn did to this ring. Like, do you guys see that? Wow. Don't even take your rings to your jewelry. Just like clean them by yourself with Dawn. Don't listen to me, that's not professional advice. I'm not sure if that's actually good for you guys to do for rings, but I mean, it's sparkling, right? Like it literally looks like it was just professionally clean, so yay. Anyways, carrying on. So yeah, only four of these. I do believe they have like like um, old fashioned glasses in that collection and then just like tall drinking glasses, but we didn't really need any more of those. I feel like we're kind of at a good place now, but we only had four shot glasses, so I bought four more. I think eight is a really good number, just in case we have friends over, cause I like to be prepared for whenever we're hosting, so. Alrighty, so another thing we got today, which I should have shown this in like the video that I filmed on Saturday, because yeah, that was the haul in which we got the rest of these, but we just got two more of these plates. Um, every time I look at these plates, I'm just like so in love with them all over again. I think they're really beautiful. We had initially gotten three from the Crate and Barrel outlet just because that was all they had left. And then I bought one more to make that number four. But we decided to get two more because we just thought six was like a better number. And so yeah, we just added two more of those. Those were also like 20% off. And I believe sadly that sale ended today. But I really, really love the plates from this collection. I just think they're so fun, especially for somebody like me that's not really into like pattern and stuff. So yeah, there's a bug on my camera, but whatever. At this point, I'm not even like phased by bugs as I used to be just because it's like they're everywhere. Anyway, so I got like the bigger version of these bowls just as a serving bowl. Look at how beautiful this bowl is, you guys. Wow. So yeah, I just got that one again for like serving and imagine right like just imagine you make a beautiful fruit salad and you serve it in this bowl and like it's in this plate of like wow the things that make me so happy <laughs> are honestly so silly but i really just like to like play around with things like this so yeah the bowl was 19.95 it sadly wasn't on sale like the other stuff which i didn't really understand but i liked it enough and i think 19.95 was actually like a good price so yeah, there we have it Ooh. so we're gonna continue with the rest of the night i'll catch up with you guys very soon for real this time okay. <laughs>
I know. Am I a tourist or am I a tourist? Good morning guys. Okay, so it is Saturday. It is currently 11 o'clock in the morning. I have a hair appointment at like 11.30, but I'm like 30 minutes away. And I am in the Starbucks drive through. So, mm, you know what? I was actually like ready a long time ago, but I had like a few distractions before I left the house because I was on track to leave at like 10.24. I was completely done. I am on my way to get my hair pressed. Oh awkward so i'm about yeah so i'm on my way to get a silk press and i hope it doesn't take too long like this girl she does amazing silk presses but like the last time i got my hair done with her it just took entirely too long like i think i was there for four hours and i think a silk press should not take more than two hours i think that's reasonable but i hope we're done with that quickly so yeah that's what we're about to do and i'm gonna get something to drink from starbucks because I am so hungry and then I have a headache like I literally had one cocktail yesterday that had champagne and vodka in it but I guess that was not a good combination because I woke up with like a throbbing headache so I hate that for me but anyways this is what my hair looks like you guys you see the straight part right here this is where like my leave out was and I hope it's not heat damaged even though I'm about to go straighten my hair more this is just my hair I have not done anything to it like I just took it out and slept with it in a bun and then I'm just taking it down right now I probably put it back in a bun and I probably put it back in a bun just so like I feel like sometimes when people see so much hair it's like oh my goodness but yeah that's what we're about to do I don't know what else I'm gonna be doing for the rest of the day honestly I don't have like any solid plans so we'll see but yeah Good morning. Can I start it for you? Hi. Um, can I get a decaf grande pumpkin spice latte? Decaf hot pumpkin spice latte? Yeah. You got it. Anything else? Uh, can I get like a small iced water? A small iced water? And then can I also get a plain bagel with butter? Plain bagel with butter. Yeah. Okay. Anything else for you today? That's it. It's going to be 826. Alrighty. Thank you. Thank you. Hi guys, it is much later in the day. I just finished doing my makeup. We're about to head to, I guess I can call it a housewarming, right? I'll just call it a housewarming, but that's where we're about to go. Um, I got my hair done earlier today. It just looks like that. I'm gonna like brush it out, but I kept it up like this so I can show you guys. Like, look at my postpartum shedding. It's like crazy. Um, This right here, I don't think it's part of like the shedding. I feel like that's like, you know, whatever I've been dealing with, psoriasis, whatever it's called. And they're kind of like gray in, but they're not as thick as I want them to be. So yeah, anyways, but I got a trim and weirdly my hair has gotten longer. It's just, it was like still shedding a little bit more than I would like. But I'm going to get ready to head out. <laughs> the event we were invited to started two hours ago. So yeah, we need to go. <laughs>
Okay, so time is not really on my side right now because I'm trying to like get this done as quickly as possible. So I'm gonna cheat the system with like one of these. I just recently bought like the bigger version, but we will we've like had this one for like a while now. And I can't wait to use the bigger version, especially for like when we're hosting. Cause like the last time we were hosting, I used this one and the time that it saved me with like chopping up veggies was ridiculous. Like I don't see any other way other than when I'm like chopping ve veggies just to be like therapeutic or whatever. But let me put this garden egg in on the stove to start cooking and then I'll start chopping up like everything else that needs to be chopped up because I'm also making chicken with it too. I think I may have already said that. If I did, just ignore me. I was gonna do the onions next, but I'm gonna go ahead and do that last, just so like my eyes don't burn and then I can't do anything else. So I'll go ahead and get the tomatoes out of the way. done with the tomatoes that took me like three minutes maybe at the most I think yeah or like I don't know yeah about three minutes and I chopped up like six minutes actually like way less than that so yeah I'm gonna do the onions last but first let me check to see how things are going on the stove
phone with my mom so I got distracted but this is all done I'm so so excited to eat this but I need to finish cooking the chicken it currently looks like this I just added like tomato paste and all that stuff and like some seasoning so I'm just letting that cook down I'm about to add in some chicken royco and then I'm gonna add in bisto because we usually add that for like our beef stew it just looks like that it's just like gravy powder and it kind of thickens it and that's about it I'll throw the chicken back in and we're done I'm gonna literally cook together blend in check for like seasonings, and we're good